Hajia Zainab Ahmed is about 13 months on the job as NATI Executive Secretary, so she had a lot to talk about the organization and the job it has to do. Top of this, obviously, is the oil industry, where NATI is expected to play a critical role in fostering transparency. This explains why the NATI Executive Secretary expressly showed support for present efforts to get the petroleum industry bill back on track. As a requirement of the NATI Act, that we will get requests for information on any document, on any process, and we are ready to provide this information. That people will ask for this information and review it before sitting back in their offices or wherever it is they are and making conclusions. NATI is ready to provide information at any time. NATI itself has had to deal with issues of transparency with regards to the process which led to the engagement of two Nigerian firms to carry out oil and gas audit as well as the first solid minerals audit. Haji Zainab explained that the public procurement procedure was complied with. It was not based on the websites. There was no requirement on the adequacy of the websites of these companies. But because of the reaction that we got. We had met with these two companies. We have told them to upgrade their website with the information that they provided for. The executive secretary announced that NATI is organizing its first national conference, bringing together the legislative, civil society, companies in the extraction sector, government officials and other sectors of the Nigerian economy to discuss the implementation of the extraction industry transparency initiative. In Abuja, Ibrahim Adra, NTA News 24.